Hey guys, this is Pharaoh 2091 and welcome back to Let's Play Batman Arkham Asylum. Last time we left off, we, uh, well, we were in a close call with, uh, what's his name there? Joker. And, um, well, that was it really Joker. Yeah, well, either way, we got in here and, uh, it was hardly, uh, hardly couldn't cut the ropes here. And now, uh, we had to do a large climb. I believe we're just about out. Oh boy, there's a lot of them here. Well, let's go kill them. Well, not kill them, but let's go fight them. This shouldn't be too bad. I, I actually love when there's a lot of enemies to fight here. It's like... God, I don't know, there's... Ah, oh, damn it all, I messed it up. There's just so much to do and... Come on, eh, ground, eh, there we go. And... Boom. Alright, that could have gone a lot better. I, re I really try getting my, you know, I love trying to get my combo up high, you know, or high Not up. Yet, but I'm getting close. Harley Quinn tried to slow me down, dropped an elevator on me. Did it work? <laughs> of course not. I'll get back to you when I reach the end of the trail. Really? Well, yeah, it didn't work. That is true, but, uh, still. Actually, I'm just taking a quick look, make sure that, um, hmm... Okay, let's make sure there's nothing else here besides this, uh, this Joker teeth, set of teeth right there. For some reason, I did not show up on my, um, I didn't show up on my guide. Eh. I know I really shouldn't worry too much about, you know, getting all the collectibles, but I'm, I'm kind of invested in doing it in, in this game. I don't know why. Yeah. And I, don't, I don't know why the hell the vents are a little bit Please. iffy for me in this game. Oh God! I, to. I just want to. <laughs> okay, watch this. That's no jacked up, back. really. Moves, shoot it. You got it. Anyone coming this way is dead. All right, so let's try to detect mode, and you'll see something here that's different. Oracle, Joker's men have taken control of the cell block transfer corridor. That's not good. I patched into a guard radio. It sounds like Joker's crew have got their hands on weapons. I know. I'll calibrate the cowl's vision mode to isolate armed henchmen. <clears throat> All right. The direct approach is suicide. I need to be smart. Find a different way past them. And just as Batman says, you cannot face these people with guns. I mean, if there's one of them, maybe, but you never want to do that because they'll, you, they'll just light you up and you're screwed. So anytime you see people like you know who are armed, which will always show up as red. You kind of need to get past them, and this is actually a good way to do so. So it's like, yeah, okay, and we can drop down silently by doing like, oh, and actually here's like the uh, hang we did, and if somebody's under me now because I have an inverted takedown mode or move, I can just take them down like this. But you know, screw it. Let's drop down, and if we crouch, we can actually go in for a silent takedown, and we do this, and the other guys, well. They won't know what's going on. You know, if it was me, I would just like, hey, you know, that sounds kind of odd, but nope. I'm just gonna choke you the hell out, and well, there you go, nighty night. I don't know if you really gotta choke them out or you really gotta take them down, but you know, it's I think it's a safer bet to do so actually. And I'm just making sure there's nothing here I'm missing. Actually, did that thing open? No, oh, it's door, door locked. Okay. And I remember this This is also part of the demo as well. Actually, that that room where uh, we we knocked out Victor Zaz, I think it, the vent went, no problem, went into this room. So it's kind of odd. That makes a demo, so, you know. Good! Our friendly neighborhood rodent is on his way. You need to set a trap. He must not leave this building. Do you understand me? Uh, yes, boss. The bet is as good as deal. I hope you keep your promises, boy. I'd hate to have to go and punish your family just to teach you a lesson. And I can promise you, they won't be laughing. <laughs> but Joker! Yeah, but, 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 but just do it and have fun. I know I will. <laughs> ah. He was kind of threatening his family there, huh? Ah, screw it. This guy doesn't know any better, so knock you out as well. 
I think after doing so, Joker will come on the TV there. If I'm not, if I'm not mistaken. There he is. Okay, and in the next, well, I mean, in this next room, it's kind of where the demo finished off, like after clearing out the room, it's actually another huge aspect of this game. And, well, it's something I'm not very good at, but, you know, hey. With a quick update on what's new in the asylum. Attention, we have an escaped patient, dresses like a bat. Oh, what an idiot. Should be considered costumed and dangerous. Personally, I think the best solution is to put him out of his misery. It's the only reliable cure. So yeah, this is known as a predator room, where we're going to be seeing a lot of these enemies, and we want to make sure they don't, they don't want to, they can't catch us. Because if they do, then we're pretty much screwed and we just have to escape from them. Uh, seems like there's only one guy, and he is... Can easily just glide kick him. So yeah, at these predator rooms, it's like you know the whole purpose is using stealth and you know being creative. I'm not creative at all and not really that stealthy. At least I try to be, but um, it's it's whatever. Crap. Let's see. Where the hell are they? Oh. Joker wants him found. Spread out. He could be anywhere. Then keep your eyes open. Now move. That's true. I could be anywhere. He's not. I don't even see I'm me sure though. He's real. Mm. <laughs> I mean, I've seen loads of people dress up in my time, but who knows? Even one of you could be the Batman. Really? Batman. Who's that? Oh. Let's we'll take a closer look at that later. I gotta get rid of these guys though. I might want to get up on this. Oh, actually, I probably should have stayed there. Ugh. There's a takedown where I can do is, like, go from under, or smack them from on top of the, uh, uh, on top of the glass there. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> actually, I could probably show off the inverted takedown right here. Now, even if I hang like this, they should not be able to see me. Come on. Come on, you're so freaking close. So, these prior modes, or just prior rooms, I'm not very good at, but, you know, hey, whatever, so... Here's the inverted takedown. And then doing, like, after that, it's like, huh. They'll notice the screams, like, oh, what the hell's going on? And it's like, you can kind of scare them by cutting this guy down. So now it's like, oh, God. Oh, I didn't want to do that. Oopsie daisy. He probably knows where I'm at now. Actually, I wonder. Can I, can I even do another inverted takedown here, or is it is it too late? Uh, Hell with this, huh? Where's he actually? Um, where? Oh man, they're both right there. I was, oh wait, I can do another inverted takedown. Okay, easy enough. So yeah, I wasn't very imaginative here, but uh, screw it all. Boom. And that should be it. Yeah, it's like, either I, to me, it's like either people enjoy the, the predator mode, or predator rooms, or people enjoy the the combat. I like the combat. Okay. So that's really all the... Ooh, wait a minute. Yeah, that's really all there is to it right now. We're not going to get anyone else, so we're kind of free to explore just a teeny bit. I don't think, I don't think we're going to be able to find much. Except, um, let's see, there should be an interview tape somewhere. And here it is. And they, they, they're bright orange whenever you, um, you're in detective mode. Patient interview number one. So, I'm your first. Hello, Tuts. You know what they say. You never forget your first time. I'll try to make it memorable for you. Oh, you already have. Tell me, why do you do the things you do? Why do you? Sense of humor. <sighs> You're good. 
you figure me out, Doc. I've had doctors poking around in here for years, and no one was as astute, and if you don't mind my saying, beautiful as you. Really? Why, you're just playing with me. Well, you'll never know, will you? Unless... Unless what? Tell me! So, yep. It seems like that's that was the beginning of uh, Joker corrupting Harleen Quinzel. You would think, you know, being a doctor and everything, she would actually be smart enough not to fall for that, but, you know, hey, whatever. So let's uh, actually take a look here, if I can actually get off. Oh, didn't want to do that. God, it's not even that cold. I remember yesterday it was freaking hot, and now it's cold, and um, ice cream trucks are outside. Oh, this is great. Huh, who is that? Joker must have figured out how I was tracking Gordon. Officer Bull's trail stops here. Oh, he's dead. Well, I guess that's what happens only when you're a traitor. So let's actually get rid of these uh Joker teeth. We don't need them. There you go. So yeah, that is the Riddler. He does... This is his appearance in the game. This whole Riddler trophies and the collectibles. He doesn't physically appear until Arkham City. So, he'll be giving you riddles and whatnot you have to solve here and there. And one of them is, well, don't cut yourself on this sharply observed portrait. As you can see I right here... Don't cut yourself on this sharply observed portrait. I was speaking, Edward. Uh, so yeah, obviously we have a portrait here of Warden Warden Sharp. So once you have once you have it, you can just hold it, and boom, we have a solved so riddle. Oh, you did it! Well done. I would have expected a child to work that one out, let alone the world's greatest detective. <laughs> so yeah, now the Riddler's Challenge uh, tab opens up. I, Edward Nigma, have placed a dazzling <laughs> selection of challenges and puzzles around Arkham. Can you solve them all? Will you find all my trophies? Are you ready to give up? Your puny mind is no match for my own. Mm, okay. So basically, to defeat Edward Nigma or the Riddler, we have to find every single piece of his trophies, which is what? There's 240 of them. That's quite a lot, actually. Found 12 so far. And these include, like, uh, destroying the teeth. Uh, so, like, as you can see here. Um, finding all of those those chronicles, the um, there's a bunch of riddles here, kind of like this one. You don't know jack about Gotham. You don't know jack about Gotham. And what else is there? There's like the trophies, and there's like a mystery. It's like what the hell is that? The also interview tapes, but also like whenever you see something like um something like popping up like that, you know that it's in the, the room you're in right now. Sides, but only some. Visible. Now these, these are hate. These I really, really hate. These are basically puzzles. Hey, Hello, guard. Hey, kind of freaked me out. Though. The facial animations really do freak me out in this game. Um, where am I? I feel like I'm not in the right areas anymore. Oh, wait. Huh. Oh, wait, no, I'm still confused where exactly where I'm at. Oh, okay, never mind. So, um, yeah, these puzzles I kind of hate. Basically, we have to find the, 
we gotta find the Riddler's markings, in a sense, and kind of like line them up. It's... It, it can be sometimes a pain in the ass. Now... I thought this was supposed to be in this room, but I guess not? Or am I mistaken? Hmm. Let's see here a minute. Oh, because I was in the... Oh, I was in the bottom. Let's see here. I don't see anything. The thing is, you can only see it when you're in detective mode, so that makes things a a little bit more um, a little bit more difficult. But you know, what can you do? Uh, let's see. I'm just taking a look and make sure I can find it. That's the reason, like sometimes playing this game with a guide. It, Tends to slow me down, and that's why I was a little unsure about doing this LP. But I've been meaning to do this game for the longest time, and well, I want to uh, be able to do it. So, sh no. Up. Oh, all right. So that, there it is, right there. But it's like, wait a minute, where's the bottom half? Well, here's where it gets a little, well, if you want to say, kind of crappy, where you kind of have to find the. Um, other side of it in a sense like the, the bottom portion in terms of like how you angle it and whatnot so I found that where the hell's the oh wait all right you see it there you go that's how you do it once you line it up you have to hold the scan button it's not it's not aligned now ah, there you go don't oh. get too full of yourself dark knight it only gets harder from here and it does yeah, that, I really, really hate those, but, um, what can you do? Oh, yeah, those are really going to drive me insane in the future, but, well, uh, for the time being, well, we'll just take it as we go. I love how these guards actually have names to them, but you never really speak them again. It was a massacre. Bulls came walking in telling everyone to cover the front entrance. Said something about Joker's army coming through the main gate. Two of my guys moved to the exit, and Frank shot him dead. They never stood a chance. Was Bulls alone? Thought he was. Then I saw Harley Quinn. She was surrounded by Black Gate prisoners. They were just killing everyone in the room. I had no choice. I, I got in here, locked the door. I, I could see it on the security feed. They had someone with them. It looked like the commissioner. Bowles is dead. They carried on without him. Must have outlived his usefulness. Good. He was scum. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, it's hard to feel bad for somebody. I'll it's like... Maria. I promise. Oh, that's sad. It's kind of hard to feel bad for one of these guys. Like, that for Bowles. I mean, it's like, well, he, tra he was a traitor. I know we see this Riddler trophy, but we sadly cannot get it right now. But there is a Riddler uh, uh, thing right here. It says, you don't know Jack about Gotham. Tune in to find out. Now, this one, it's not super hard. And you can, where you can hear music. We apologize for this interruption to our regular broadcast. Jack Ryder is live from the Gotham Bay Area with some breaking news. This is Jack Ryder with breaking news hmm. in the Gotham Bay. You don't know Jack. About Gotham, tune in. Two minutes ago, I think you guys understand that now. This chilling message. This is the voice of your new master. Oh, hang on. <laughs> I skipped a bit. <clears throat> Joker here. I'm in control of Arkham Island, and you can all consider it out of bounds. I see any lawmen, vigilantes, or do gooders in tights coming this way, I'll start detonating random bombs around the city. What's it be? A kindergarten? A hospital? A billionaire's mansion? Oh, choices, choices, choices. All access to the island has been restricted. Airspace is closed off, and early reports suggest that Batman himself is trapped on the island. We'll be right here, reporting live on any developments. Back to the studio. Thanks, Jack. More as it happens. Wouldn't necessarily say I'm trapped on here, but, you know, hey, I'm just trying to, trying to track you down. So, yeah, 
we're actually now moving on to a new area of this game where, well, well, things start opening up. However, we will start investigating the new areas in the next episode, guys. So, as usual, thank you all for watching, and I'll see you guys next time for, for Let's Play Batman Arkham Asylum. I'll see you guys later.